They're going out with another teacher. Good morning, Mr. Egan. Good morning, Mr. Jarvis. My class has gone out for the day. Oh, if you haven't got anything else, though, so you can come and help out. You need some help, do you? Yes, please. All right. To help cook in the school kitchen, I have to wear a clean white overall and wash my hands. You must have clean hands when you make food. Would you like to help me with the pineapple meringue? Pineapple meringue. Here the blackboard are. tells us what's for school dinner. That's the pudding for today. Pineapple meringue. That's what I'm going to make. Here are some of the things I need. Eggs. 24 eggs to make the meringue. All you do is just crack it anyway. Watch the cook. She's separating the egg yolk from the egg white. Right. She puts the white of egg in one basin and the yolk in the other. Would you like to have a go now? Now it's my turn. Let's see now. Whoops! That's not very good. I'll have to do better than that. I'll just clean up the mess and try again. That's better. It's 10 o'clock already. In two hours at 12 o'clock, it will be dinner time. Everyone is very busy. There are lots of jobs to be done. The cabbage has to be cut up in a big machine. Cook wants me to help her carry the big pot. It's very heavy. It's full of custard for the pineapple meringue. It's time to put the egg yolks into the custard. I have to stir as Cook pours in the egg yolks. I have to stir very hard. That will mix in the egg yolks. The egg yolks have to be mixed into the custard really well. It's half past ten. Dinner will be in one and a half hours at 12 o'clock midday. Now it's time for Cook to roll the pastry for the meat pies. What a lot of pastry. It has to be rolled flat. There's the tin filled with meat, and there's the pastry to cover it. The pie is nearly ready to be put into the oven to cook. Look how fast the other helpers are working. They all have their special jobs to do, and everything must be ready by 12 o'clock. This is the pineapple for the pineapple meringue. We only want the pineapple pieces. We don't want the juice. Look at the time. It's 11 o'clock. There's only one hour left. I should be making the meringue. I need the egg whites for that. This is a very big egg beater. It works very fast. I wonder how long it will take to beat the egg whites. Not too long, I hope. You can see through the egg whites now. But watch what happens when I switch on the beater.
the beater is beating the egg whites. Watch them change. They're turning white. The egg whites are getting thicker and thicker. The noise has changed. I'll switch on again and add some sugar. The beater will mix the sugar into the egg whites and make the meringue. There we are, a whole bowl of meringue. How long did that take? We started at 11 o'clock, so it's taken quarter of an hour. I must hurry. Cook's doing part of my job for me. She's put the pineapple into the custard, and now she's pouring it into the baking dishes. I've got the meringue ready for her. Now the custard is in the baking tins, we can put the meringue on top. It looks just like snow, doesn't it? Now I can decorate the top with pieces of pineapple. It's half past eleven. I hope the pineapple meringues will be ready in time. They have to go into the oven to brown. All the helpers are busy. They know that there isn't much time left. Only a quarter of an hour till dinner time. But all the pineapple meringues are ready. The tops have gone brown in the oven. Don't they look good? The dinner ladies are laying the tables in the dining hall. Ten minutes to go. All the plates must be ready in piles. Only five minutes to go. The grave is almost ready. It's nearly dinner time. Everything's lovely and hot. Twelve o'clock, dinner time. Everybody is hungry, and the meat pie smells lovely. After they've eaten the meat pie, they'll have my pineapple meringue. I hope they enjoy it.